everybody! Welcome back to a screen you might never have expected to see anymore. It's been two, three months even after leaving this off, but uh, we are back with FIFA 16 Seasons. The reason why I'm doing this is because the last FIFA video I recorded was uh, Heracles and Mello, and I got fucked over. So, online, I always think at least, you can get fucked over less. So, let's just jump straight to the season. As you can see, um, if you remember at least, last time when we left off we were in Division 6. I myself moved up to Division 5, I've been doing very well lately. So in Division 5, let's hope we can win and move on to the Division 4 in a few uh, episodes. Because this might be the thing I'm going to do for a while once again, because Heracles just pisses me off. Uh, they really do. The fact that I got screwed over that much. You, If you, if you saw the video, you know exactly what I'm talking about, so it doesn't really matter. But I'm Dortmund, um, it will just be for this video, because I myself do like using Dortmund, and that is what I use um, off camera. But um, on camera, I guess, the next video I'll be using a different team. But like I said, I've been doing well lately, so hopefully I can continue that trend here today against Napoli. We can tell he knows the game. He had a sixth sense there to get to the right position and nick the ball. Oh, oh, fuck. That w why the hell did Castro do a fake shot? I don't remember telling him that, but whatever. Alba out of the fucking turn while standing still. That shot almost flies in. Oh, there you go. There you go. That's how you play football. And that's it. 1 0. Castro, really? Kagawa now, though, even though he doesn't play a good game, he scores a fantastic goal. Placing the ball in the bottom left corner, the bottom right corner, I should say. Just look at this brilliance from him. Japanese mastermind. I think definitely the best Japanese player at this moment in time. Look at this. Turns around and just, with the finest of touches, just strokes the ball into the bottom right corner. 1 0. And that is most definitely deserved. Oh, what a goal! Team goal of the fucking... It's, I don't know what I'm going for there, but this goal is a stroke of brilliance. Look at that. Passing around like it's nothing, and then that finish from Royce. That is just majestic. 2-0. <laughs> okay, apparently that's how you get your shit together. And that's a good cross, and that's the 3-0. This is becoming very simple. This man looked like a really decent opponent when I started out because his pressure was getting to me. But he sees as well that I'm a very good player. I can easily pass out under his... Uh, how, how should I say this? I can easily get rid of his pressure by just passing well and uh, passing the ball around. Not letting him touch the ball once. And that way, look at this. This guy's got a rage quit. Like I said, his pressure, his pressure really did seem too much. But I can easily pass out under that pressure. So, fantastic. Why is it so hard for me to say what I want to say? Pass out under that pressure. That, that sounds like I'm going to fucking faint. Because the pressure is too much. Oh, forgive me people. English is my second language. I'm just going to use that as, as an excuse. So, yes. Great. Move on to the second game. Let's uh, not be this uh, awkward right now. We're facing Real Madrid. But it might be the same player. I got no clue. Might be. Yeah, I don't see the necessity for this, but sure. I'm sure this man has his reasons. Whatever they might be, because that to take that long for a fucking goal kick and get this out of it, I'm sure uh Yeah. I'm just going to take that as a fluke, and I hope this guy's still a good player because I don't want to dominate him as well. Because it it does get kind of boring when your opponent doesn't really put up much of a force. Hummels, use your body. I know it, fucking Ronaldo himself is strong, but use come on, use your body, and that's going to be the one of him, isn't it? Yes, it is. Well, the first chance they get, and they score a goal. I guess that is what I get for uh, calling out somebody for not being a good player. <laughs> get talk shit, get hit. Gagawa though, that's the one. Gagawa? What? How the fuck do you miss a chance like that? Oh, 
Oh, that was a really shitty cross. But in the end, because of luck, Ferrari passes it in towards my fucking chest. And the Bummer Young says, thank you, mate, and scores it. Look at it, this course right here isn't that brilliant. But Varane passes it onto my chest and once again Aubameyang doesn't think twice and scores the goal. Damn mate, could you calm the fuck down? You might get a red card here. He gets this. He fucking slid in from behind with both feet. Really, nothing. Ronaldo again. It seems to be. What the hell is he done now? Yeah, logically he's going to get a card now. What the fuck are you doing? What I do know now, though, is that it can annoy this guy into making a second tackle with Ronaldo and giving him a red card. That would be brilliant. Either way, I think a 1-1 is deserved. His defense, his defense is pretty good, and my defense is pretty good, and both of our attacks has, have not been that, that amazing so far. So, a 1-1 is definitely uh, deserved. On the attack here. Kaga won. that is the 2-1. He missed a huge chance in the first half, but this one, just like a score in the last game, is stroked in with perfection. Look at this. Hey, he fucking even... The, the commentator says it, stroked in from outside the books. He, even he says it. He knows that is brilliant. Because that's the only time you use the word stroked in a football game, is when somebody does something brilliant. Otherwise, you're just speaking absolute fucking bullshit. Like I am right now, so let's just stop. Oi, 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 fucking Borky, get your shit together. I was saying to... Holy shit, that was a fucking freak out by me. I was telling him... I was fucking telling him to do a, a, a lob pass towards a Bamiyang. Then that sort of shit comes out. Added time coming up, there'll be two minutes. No, Borky, no, no, but it is deserved, but no. I thought I could... Ah, fuck. <sighs> I thought I could keep him at 2-1. I don't know if his, this was his tactic that worked out, but it didn't seem to be the case as it was Ronaldo and Bill. Danilo was nowhere to be seen, but... They do score the 2-2, and frankly, it is most definitely deserved. They have been better. I cannot say much more than that. Oh, I get a free kick right here by being an absolute douchebag. And I'm liking that because I could score a goal. Oi! Oh, Navas, what a save! Oh, fuck my heart. Well, in the end, it definitely deserved 2-2. Um, offensively, they were pretty strong, but they couldn't get a lot of shots off. We weren't that strong, but we got a bit more shots off, if I believe correctly. Yeah, more shots, but we weren't that strong. They were strong, but they didn't get that, that, didn't get that much shots off. So, in the end, very deserved 2-2. I've definitely enjoyed myself here. I didn't enjoy myself during Heracles on Malacarama, mode because fuck Edo, fuck FIFA. But still, this, these two games were brilliant. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe and I will see you guys in the next video.